So we are uh, embarking now on a on an equity campaign to really get this cellulosic sugar producers cooperative up and running. Ultimately, this uh, business will be the co-op will be 100% farmer owned, and the farmers who own the co-op will also be the suppliers of the biomass that the plant we're going to own shares in requires. So this will be what's called a closed co-op, and to sell biomass to the plant, you have to be an investor. So our proposition here will be for you to consider ownership in the co-op. When the plant is built, the co-op will own something around 30% of the plant. We are, first of all, asking uh, interested farmers to sign a supply agreement, which says you would sign up an acre of crop. We'd like it to be about two-thirds corn, one-third wheat and then we will take the stove off of that. So you'd be signing a production agreement basically that says, I will sign up, let's call it 200 acres, where I will supply you the biomass off of my field. Uh, then in turn, we're asking you to invest $200 per acre you sign up. So if you signed up uh, 200 acres, you'd be making a $40,000 investment in the plant. Uh, so through the co-op. Typical co-op, it's one member, one vote. So you'll have one set of shares, which are your voting membership shares, and the rest are uh, class one preference shares. For that investment of 200 acres, our projections are that you get about a $62 an acre return. As far as farmers, we need 55,000 acres of contract, 55,000 acres contracted to feed the biomass into this plant. Um, and so you can do the math yourself, whether people average 200 or 300 acres, something in that window. And farmers will have about $11 million uh, into it. So the money we're asking you for today would actually be held in escrow until such time as we're shovel ready. And that's really unique in the co-op development world to get a project where the farmers aren't having to take the risk of funding all the work it takes to get ready to go.